Ali, which is kind of cool. Yeah. As a combo, outside of that, kind of dislike it. Yeah, it's not level. feeling great. <laughs> now, they can just play for Eliordian. I mean, they could go for Eliordian, and they could have also played a double AD lane. Um, the Varus would have been obviously ideal, but they banned that away. Draven also gone with the stronger pairings with the Ash. Could have played Caitlyn. It wouldn't even usual as Umpty. All right. We've got a bit of a crash here as in goes F. It finds the pole bond to both. And Pays is going down extraordinarily low, but he's not dead yet. He picks up first blood. And now Delight is looking to try and answer this one back. We've seen some Braums before. you max on Braum, as we know. As Poppy making his way down. That is a headbutt flash pole from Effort. Does manage to find the stun onto Pays with the trample, and Pays knows that it is all done. That's going to be the kill, and Bro really finding the angles. Or you have an Emperor's Divide engaged, Doran alone. Yeah, that's another ult going to be used as the dice going to come forward. They do manage to get the ulti. That is going to knock up Doran. He gets the trigger C, but I don't know whether it's going to be enough, and Morgan is going to cull him. And now, Peanut just trying to keep it. does have teleport. It's unleashed at 13 minutes. Yep. And there's the static ship that Doran has. So now, if it doesn't work, first brick going over the Genji here on the bottom side of the map in the meantime. So they try to catch Doran. He healing of any significance. Hey, Umpty picks up a buckler and shields himself. Triumphant roar exists. Effort, Effort. is out there. He's going to need to use it as Delight is going to flash and try and get himself out. But Doran is the one that's in trouble. And he will just explode. The Ren gets so much value. And Daisy's going to fall. Pop at 18 minutes without Doran. I guess the answer is yes. Uh, I don't know if it should be. Oh, it's a flash from Morgan. They're going to get the knock up as well as Effort is just looking so good on this Alistair. They take down Pays. Delight puts up the door, but they're walking through anyway. I don't think that there's anything that's going to stop Bro. This, this Callista moment. is four. And then he's with this follow up here going to be able to take the kill. The charm does connect. And we're wilding again. Yeah, exactly. That's the bounce house here for Peanut. Nowhere that he can go. Effort's able to headbutt his way out. Taxis himself. Funny business. The shenanigans from Doran. As Gen G, they'll take another inner turret. And this is. They know they're in this brush. They have to know. Yeah. They have to know. It's going to connect on Umpty there. Volt comes forward. A dangerous one. As Umpty gets the set pass presence off just a little bit late now. Effort finds the back line. It's a big pulverize. And there's the fate call as well. Hannah He's down to 50%. He's cleansed though. And they take down the Braum. Keeper's verdict is. Now they're on this Baron. Gen G really need to be decisive here. As Effort's on the flank. He's caught. Yeah, there's the Empress Divide Effort. It's just going to flash. Get the headbutt onto Trophy. But the Sand Soldier is in position. But the Baron, they're going to have to back away. Doran's back in this fight one more time. Good charm. It's going to connect onto Peanut. And they managed to blow him up. But can Genji stand their ground? Jovi is going to get flashed on. And Hannah just taking matters a little bit too far into his own hands. Karis tidies up the kill under the Ash, but not before she gets a double. And now Jovi's trying to weave the autos. The Orb of Deception has to be avoided. And that means the Jovi. Bro, going to spot it out. This ward right in the middle of the river, proving to be a problem for Genji. There's Umpty. Oh, it's a battle of the ages. Gonna get knocked up by Daisy though, and oh no! Umpty! He's gonna be taken down. It's Peanut that locks up the kill, and now there's no smite! And now Gen G should just be able to freely get Baron! They also have these Ivern brushes here, and Doran's on the flank. This is so critical. Oh, so many control wards. So Doran gonna be spotted out here. But he can zone, he can just be in the area. Morgan, maybe we'll see another play from him, but no flash. Yep, Arrow is gonna go completely wide as Daisy, Daisy gets amongst it. They're going to lock that one down. There it is. Gale Force does a little bit of work there as Effort just says, well, I'll just, I'll be the sacrifice. Hopefully everybody else can get out as that's a nice charm from Karis used defensively. Chovy going to come on over. It's a minute and a half on the Drake, so it's not like they can transition into that. But Morgan is going to go down. Doran collects that kill on his opposite number. And that You're is losing your jungle than trying to come over and deny a Baron. You're just walking into a meat grinder. Yeah, speaking of which, um, that is the cow going down. Looks like this inhibitor turret is not long for the world. See Pays moving from very far away. Splash back available in a couple of seconds time. It does have the arrow at the ready. See whether it can actually land here if they are going to go for some sort of engagement. But Genji looking to try and uh, dot some eyes and cross T's at this point in the game. As, oh my goodness, the damage from these Sand Soldiers is just massive from Trovi with his three items prepared. Get that Alistair ult out early in the fight with the arrow and now with these Cannon minions are powered by Ban Baron. Yeah, they are just sieging up. First Nexus turret is going to go down, and oh my goodness, Hannah just explodes! 
Dorian just does so much work there with the blind on the Q. The Empress Divide comes down. The cow is going to die yet again. It's a kill for Chovy. Karras will have to go into his stopwatch. And Genji, they will be able to claim the 2-0. But I have to say, Bro made him work for it this time around. Just some heartbreaking mistakes, some inactivity that has plagued them in the past. This is the closest that they've got to winning a game against Genji in the long...